This is part 4 of the series. We are going to look at two models, Falcon 7B Instruct and GPT 3.5. We want to see how they do when it comes to figuring out stuff about the financial market. The link for the code is available in the description of this video given below. Let's kick off by setting up our environment and installing all the requisite packages. We set up the Langchain Multidoc Retriever with ChromaDB. We import all the necessary functions. We download the data from my GitHub account using these codes. Moving forward, we initialize a directory loader designed to load text from data source name stock underscore market underscore June underscore 2023. Loading all the present documents into the directory. Then we initialize a recursive character text splitter with a specified chunk size in our lab. Split the loaded documents into a chunk of text using a defined text underscore splitter. We set up our Falcon 7B instruct model. Falcon 7B is a strong base model. It has been trained on 1.5 token and does better some other model similar models such as MPT7B, Stable LM, Red Pajama. Falcon 7B was trained using B float 16 data type, so I use the same here. But I don't use 4 bit or 8 bit precision just to be able to run the model in its full power. And then we need to make it true, this true underscore remote underscore code. This is because the mo model uses a new architecture that is not the transformers yet. Then this is followed by setting up a text generation pipeline that integrates the pre-trained model and tokenizer. We then proceed to load the embedding using E5 large V2. Next we set up the directory where the embeddings will be stored and we call embedding equal to just HF. The chroma module is used to transmute the text into a bedding using the assigned hugging face embeddings. We set up some other stuff here and we specify key k equal to 3. So that means that the ritual will return the top 3 most similar vector for each query. Then we start up with the ritual QA object with LLM stuff retriever and we make this uh, return underscore underscore documents equal to tree that means that the original source document will be included in the return results and this function process the response from the LM model and prints the results and the resources let's look at the question that I asked the first question is the could you please enumerate the companies that have been highlighted for their potential stock growth? Answer is sure. The companies that have been highlighted as potential for their stock growth are, are Harbor Metal, Tesla, Kipling Metals, Microsoft, Nvidia, Shopify, Intuity Surgical, and Mercury Libre. So let's look at the answer from GPT 3.5. The function of the code is quite similar. Uh, so I'll just jump to uh, where uh, the query is just to be able to compare both the answers from uh, Falcon 7b and GPT 3.5. So same question is here. Could you please enumerate the companies that have been highlighted for their potential stock growth? The companies that have been highlighted for their potential stock growth are Harbor Metal, Tesla, Plane, Microsoft, Nvidia, Shopify, Intuity Surgical and Mercado Libre. So you can see that yes the answer is almost like 100% similar. Let's look at the uh, another questions. I think this uh, I ask a bit si simple questions. How much has Microsoft invested in OpenAI? Microsoft has invested 1 billion in OpenAI. So you can see uh, we have a uh, let's look at the response from uh, GPT 3.5. 
so is here uh, how much Microsoft has invested in OpenAI so it's responded that Microsoft has invested 1 billion in OpenAI okay so let's look at the uh, other questions that what were the reason behind Shopify decision to lay off its portion of its workforce yes you can see this is a slightly difficult question the reason behind Shopify decision to lay off a portion of its workforce are likely related to their effort to adapt to the changing landscape by reducing our head cost and becoming more asset light so let's look at the response from GPT 3.5 so uh, what were the reason behind Shopify decision to lay off a portion of its workforce so the answer is to reduce our head cost and make Shopify more asset like in the long run so you can see the answer is quite short here but it has given so some more detail by this Falcon 7 B in stock model but uh, but I, I, I believe that answer is quite good from this Falcon 7 B in stock model let's look at the other questions how many companies that have been highlighted for their potential stock growth so there are eight companies that have been highlighted for their potential stock growth so let's look at the similar questions uh, response from the GPT 3.5 how many companies that have been highlighted for their potential uh, stock growth so we can see here that answer is eight so it just said answer is eight yeah so simple answer okay uh, what are the fi top five companies and how much their stock value increase the top five companies based on the stock value increase are Palantir 74% Nvidia uh, CrowdStrike Holdings 30% Shopify and then in the last says that our insights and articles about these stocks collectively yielded a remarkable 57 percent return last month for our readers who took action on our recommendation so let's look at the response from gpt 3.5 palantir soar 74 percent nvidia growth 34 percent crowd strikes 30 percent Shopify saw a rise of over 19% in our inside articles collectively yielded remarkable 57% last month for our readers who took actions our recommendation so you can see that the answers are almost like 100% similar so with the uh, Falcon B and instruct model and GPT 3.5 okay so I ask again a bit difficult question how does Nvidia dominance in the GPU market contributes to its strategic position in the AI industry so Nvidia dominance in the GPU market provides it with a significant advantage over competitors when it comes to supplying the specialized hardware required for training AI models with an 80% market share in advanced graphic processing units GPUs Nvidia ables to is able to leverage economies of scale to produce high performance hardware at a lower cost uh, than the other manufacturers so let's see a response from GPT model is the Nvidia dominance in the GPU market allows him to provide hardware like like a hundred and h hundred chips to AI performs so you can see the only difference is that they, they both mentioned provide hardware the only difference is that they, they mention here the specific chips that it provides to the market and this reinforces confidence in Nvidia technological leadership and help drive their uh, higher share price okay so this talk about how actually we didn't ask the share prices we just said their dominance uh, and in the end if you see the answer is quite uh, good from this uh, Falcon 7 being stuck the it had uh, some extra information that we can see that the GPU mark enabled to capture a large portion of the growing industry which is expected to reach uh, 2 trillion by 2023 so in the end of all that we find that the Falcon 7 being stuck model gives us answer that are a lot like that we get from GPT 3.5 Oh, this is pretty cool it means that Falcon 7 B in stock could be a great substitute for GPT 3.5 thanks for watching video